Hi guys, I'm Nikki and I'm here to teach you how to get big curls like this without using any heat at all. All you need is a bottle of water and hair. All right, let's get started. I just took a shower and then I blow dried my, blow -dried my hair straight and this is how it's gonna be. So you want your hair to be natural, no products in it. This is just washed. So to start out, you wanna get like your bangs and stuff that you don't want to be curled out of the way and then just take, you can start anywhere. Just take a little chunk of hair. Um, my hair is really thick and really long, so like this amount of hair will be good for me because it's not like overbearing. Like the, the, the chunk of hair that you take is gonna be one curl. So this is the size I want my curls to be. Spray it with water. Just down it once. It doesn't need to be soaking wet, just kind of damp. And then you're gonna take the hair and twist it like this. Either direction is fine, it doesn't really matter, and it doesn't need to be super twisted. Two fingers as high up as you want the curl to start. And then you pull it up and you begin to wrap it above the curl, uh, above your fingers. Like this. And then once you have like this little tail left, separate your fingers, put it in between, and then Pull it through, and not all the way, there needs to be a little tail left, but then you push it down over the knot, so that it's like this. Because what we'll do when we're done is after we let it sit, we're gonna take this piece of hair and pull it out, and that's how you're gonna have a curl. So it's crucial that you have this, because if you do not, your hair is gonna be like, not curled first of all, but it'll also get really knotted and it'll be really hard to take out. So don't pull all of your hair through. And then you just repeat. So I'll help you with a couple more and then we'll fast forward and you can just watch. So, chunk of hair, get it wet, twist, like so, fingers, wrap it around, and then through, and push it down. Now that we're done, we wait. I am gonna go watch some Law & Order for, I don't know, a couple hours, maybe like two hours, three, four at the max. Um, and then we'll come back and we'll take these out and look fabulous. All right, so it's been um, four hours since I put my hair up and now let's take them out. So you're just gonna take them and take the pieces of hair that's on the edge and pull. Ta-da! Look at that! It's a curl! So, take them out. And I know I said that I sleep with them in because I'll wear my hair like this to school. So I'll just do it before I go to bed. I'll shower in the afternoon, dry my hair, do it before I go to bed, and then I sleep in it and take them out in the morning and put a little hairspray in and then go to school. But so in that case, I would wait like 12 hours. I mean, I don't say 12 hours, more like eight, 10, somewhere in between that number, which is obviously much longer than four hours. So those curls would probably last much longer than these. But tonight I'm just going out for two hours. My hair doesn't need to last all night. I probably won't put very much hairspray. So, I mean, depending on how long you want the hair to stay, I would say that's how long you should keep your ponytail, uh, keep the curls in, but. This will do me fine for tonight. I'm really excited to wear it like this because I love when I get to wear my hair nice. I'm trying to find all the pieces to take out. Super easy, it literally takes a minute to take out. You just pull. It kind of feels like little bombs going off, it's funny. Because there's so much just friction, like condensed in there. And then, I mean not friction, but just like, potential energy and then you let them out and they just kind of like they make your head jerk it's funny oh all right 
and there you go. So obviously you gotta mess with it. Like this side's a lot longer than the other, but you kind of like shake your head out and voila, big curls. Awesome. Well, there you have it. Big curls with no heat at all, just like I promised. I hope you enjoy it and you can always let me know if it worked out for you, if there's anything that should be changed about it, but good luck.